In agriculture, it can be difficult to determine when it's appropriate to wear a mask or otherwise known as a respirator. It's important to protect yourself from the hazard that you can and can't see. In agriculture, there are several different types of respiratory hazards. It can be from corn, soybeans, or confinement. And with confinement, I mean like poultry, hogs, and cattle confinement. Now, the respiratory hazards are related to the dust. So dust can come with all kinds of different properties. It's not just dust. What we're most concerned about are the organic properties on dust. So that means when you're in corn or soybeans that are moldy, or in confinement, the dust particles can have things like bacteria, feces, and mold is, is an example. Also, it can have ammonia or different types of gases. So it's not just dust, it's organic dust, which can cause you to have different types of symptoms. So Lowell, um, tell me about your agricultural type of hazards or respiratory exposures that you've had, and maybe some symptoms related to that. Well, I had one instance where I was cleaning out a bean bin and I didn't realize how moldy they were, and I was physically sick for three or four days. Then I've had trouble with sinus infections if I'm not careful and don't wear a mask. Mm -hmm. And then I do have some lung scarring from uh, mold from corn. And I'm sure that that's of concern to you, and you as well, yes, you have to see because if you, if you see him having those symptoms and, and being of concern, and the symptoms that you talk about really are related to the dust properties, and mold is one of them. As I said, the organic properties can cause you to have an infectious type of, of process where you have fever, chills, shortness of breath, wheezing, and that can be called organic dust toxic syndrome, that combination of symptoms. And what we're seeing too is that you can have, the dust can be what's called respirable. So in your lungs, you have alveoli, which are the grape-like clusters where you have the oxygen exchange. So respirable dust is very, very small. 10 microns are smaller, and that's, that's extremely tiny. So the dust with those organic properties can get down deep into your lungs, into your alveoli, and that can cause you to have a long-term chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, or just some of the things you talked about, like the scarring, which can cause you to have maybe a chronic lung problems for the rest of your life, and that's of concern to us. So what we need to know is with respiratory hazards in agriculture, based on the type of exposures, it's important to have the right mask for the right job with the right fit.